To assess the environmental status of our seas, it is necessary to monitor biodiversity. But what is biodiversity and how is it possible to monitor it? During the years of devotes and previous projects, one of the interesting things is that we are all using the word biodiversity. It's one of the most frequently used keywords in biological or ecological research. But if you ask 10 people, what do you mean by biodiversity? You're going to get 10 different answers and they're all right. The internationally recognized definition of biodiversity spans from genes to species to communities, populations and to ecosystems. It covers habitats. So when I talk to you about biodiversity, maybe I'm meaning how many species are on the sea floor. And I talk to um, a fisheries expert and they're talking, they want to know how, what's the ratio of large fish to small fish. And you talk to someone else and they want to know what's, the, what's an environmental impact on the marine environment. They're all right. But we end up arguing about what is marine biodiversity. And one of the things we have done, and which I think is a very important way, is that we have tried to make a conceptual understanding of how we look at biodiversity so that we have a common communication platform. So we have made some conceptual views. We can look at biodiversity from the, the point of view of how many, what kinds of organisms I can go here and take a sample of the water or the seafloor um, and count how many animals are there. And that's one view of biodiversity. We could go and have a look at food webs. We want to know who's eating who. And that's another view. We want to know maybe how the whole ecosystem is functioning. And that would be another view. And from each of these starting points, we look at what is the critical uh, aspects. And if we want to make an assessment for each particular viewpoint, then we look at the critical aspects and we need to have indicators for each of the, these aspects. And the type of indicators you select will depend on what your question is. What is your viewpoint of biodiversity? And then you will select your indicators on that basis. And I think for, for me, that's one of the um, a very huge progress of devotes is this that we are arriving at a common conceptual understanding again what is biodiversity <laughs> <laughs>